Peace, family. Hotep. Blessings. Aquaba. <laughs> yes, I'm working on my tree. Because I will soon be in the motherland. Alright, so... I got some other stuff on my mind that I want to talk about. And... This, actually, I'm going to give a shout out to uh, Searching for Uru for Dinus for his YouTube channel. And he had a brother on there, powerful brother, uh, Dewan Owens, brother Dewan Owens. I'm giving a shout out to both of those brothers because listening to their conversation, it was just very, it just felt good. It just felt good to see my, my African kings just sitting up and reasoning about real conversations that we should be having. Conversations not about all the negatives and the woes of our people, but conversations about uplifting our people and bringing our people to, you know, uh, a higher standard of, of, uh, of thinking. And one of the things that they were talking about was actually about... How people, some people, they think, you know, okay, I'm conscious, so it's it's a virtue for me to be in poverty, or for me to be struggling, or for all of this, because, you know, I'm conscious. And I've seen that mentality throughout our community, and to me, this is how I feel about it. Whatever you want to do with your life is cool with me. Um, if you want to live in poverty... If you want to feel like you are more godlike or more goddess-like because you're struggling, that's your prerogative. But for me, to be conscious is to be divinely connected to source. This is my definition, all right? So if I am divinely connected to source, Source is the all being, the supreme being, the infinite, the abundant. I can't equate that to poverty. Like, it just, it's like it, it just doesn't make sense in my mind to equate that to poverty. You know, when I, when I think about um, consciousness being divinely connected to source, all I think about her is 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 wealth and not just in um don't get it twisted not just in in material wealth but in wealth of knowledge wealth in relationships wealth in knowing my ancestral lineage wealth in just everything beyond money and see to me money is nothing more than a form of energy it's an exchange of energy right um it is really the value that you give to others, whatever their product service may be. And that money that comes back, it's like an energy exchange. Like the, um, like the, the law of reciprocity, right? I'm a big believer in that as well. But um, I just want to know your thoughts. What's up with this? Because I'm conscious, I need to be in poverty. You know, I, I, I think that's a bullshit excuse, in my opinion, uh, because we, and when I say we, I'm speaking African people, we are the most genius, intellectual set of people on the planet, and that's why we're hated, is because we are, when you tap into that genius, <laughs> the, the world becomes a playground for you. So, I'm not telling you to change how you think. I just want to open up the conversation and kind of extend the dialogue that I heard um, with these uh, two, two kings. I just want to extend the dialogue over here and you give me your thoughts. Is, is, is being conscious, does that also equate to being in poverty? I don't know. Comment, let me know. Please subscribe, like my channel, I'm trying to grow it out. I just started it out um, a little bit ago. So I'm going to be bringing your sisters and brothers some really, really good content. I've got um, another project that we're working on. 
um, it's called Black Economic Empowerment. <clears throat> and hang on, I'm sweating, guys. I'm walking up my yellow brick road. You see it? Bam! Yes. Um, so anyways, I'm going to bring you all some really, really, really good content. Some speakers and people that I'm going to be interviewing. Talking about, uh, you know, uplifting our, our community. Uplifting Africa. But I want to personalize it. And uplift you and your family financially and that's really the key you know in this in this struggle in this revolution uh, it, it costs money man we can't <laughs> we can't have a revolution and everyone's in poverty it just doesn't work so look out for those interviews and things like that it's going to be on another channel uh we've got it up and running we just have to uh, start uploading all the content and everything like that. So uh, stay tuned to your sis. One love. Love you. Peace and blessings.